Uh, it seems like we've been walking for days. Man up! We've been walking for 47 seconds. I'm hungry. Can we stop for some toe jam jerky? No time for snacking. We're almost there. <gasps> Found it! Feast your eyes on the rarest plant in the world. The Bolognese cactus. It blooms once every 100 years. And time's almost up. It's more beautiful than I ever imagined. Okay, everyone gather around for a keepsake photo of the giant... <gasps> meatball! <laughs> Not bad, but it could use a little sprinkle of cinnamon. No! <laughs> I know it's not your conventional meat product seasoning, but... That wasn't for eating! No, spit it out! Spit it out! Stop <laughs> that tickles! No, oh, the humanity! Not to mention the strange, terrible side effects. Wait! Uh, what kind of side effects? Brain explosions, facial warts, extreme foot odor... <gasps> or maybe nothing happens. No one really knows. <laughs> now I have to wait another hundred years! Oh, okay. Back to camp. <laughs> Excuse me. Hmm. Meatball-y. No itchy bumps, brain swelling, smelly feet, or mutant hunger for human flesh? Don't think so. Then it looks like you're okay. Ow! <gasps> that funny, guys! Who lowered the door frame? Whoa! Now that's a side effect. This is the kind of side effect I can work with. Ah! Hello? Personal space! Ah! First you destroyed a bolognese meatball, now the cabin? No chocolate-covered maggots for you. Ooh, I feel a breeze. We've got to cover that giant butt. <laughs> nice short squirt. They are a tad snug. And now, for my triple backward swandinger with a twist. Yeah! Somebody help me! Loving the new look. <laughs> Sorry, still working on that cactus meatball. Hey! We're just happy it wasn't from the back end. Yeah, that could start an earthquake. <laughs> <laughs> Check it out! Walking the dogs around the world! Yeah. Huh? Whoa. I am the Yo-Yo Man! I don't know how they got a giant squirt, but I know how I'm gonna get one. <sighs> <sighs> Oops, sorry. <laughs> no problem. Big buddy. <laughs> Excuse me, guys. I got a dinkle. Well, looks like Mega Squirt's got to do a Mega Squirt. <laughs> I gotta admit it. More squirt equals more fun. Yeah. I think it's gonna wear off. Maybe in a week, maybe a hundred years. A hundred years? Give or take a decade. Who knows? Time for lunch. I hope he doesn't want seconds. Occupy! Gotta go! <laughs> Gotta go! <sighs> hey! What the fifth fuck guy gotta do to get some privacy around here? <laughs> Contact. Who's taking squirt so long? 20 times bigger, 20 times more pee. Oh! Hey! Watch where you're stomping, buddy! What's up with the dorky hat? Yeah, and why does it have a butt squat on it? Hey, bottom squishers! Your giant is mine now! Say goodbye to Mega Squirt and hello to Mighty Mega Squat! Hey! Leave our giant buddy alone, butt stink! Come on, Gretch. Let's get rid of Squirt's headache! Squirt! It's Gretchen and McGee! Don't you recognize us? Squash those bugs, Mega Squad! Yeah! Hmm? What's a zombie got to do to get a little privacy around here? Ah, smack you later, McGee! Well, 
I enjoyed being average height while it lasted. We've got to find a way to help Squirt without getting stomped. Well, there is a little project I've been working on. We got a giant robot? I never got around to finishing it. Finish! This is gonna be awesome! Let's fire this baby up! a few kinks that need to be ironed out. <laughs> Behold Mega Squad! This is so cool! What the...? Okay, Butt Sneeze! Really, Squirt, or feel the fury of Mega Bottom? I thought we were calling it Kick Butt Board. Wasn't it Junk Bottom? Robo McSuckum Bottom! I just call it Wilbur. Well, 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 if it isn't McGee and his dweeby friends inside a robo hunk of junk. Whatever, butt sneeze. Feel the fury of the... We're gonna need a bigger robot. Ha! Let the crushing commence! Squirt, no! We're your friends! Don't squash us! Huh? <laughs> okay, bottom dwellers, our pal needs us! Activate turbo jump! Turbo jump, jump. jump. go! So I can mega squish you! <laughs> no problem. Activate Mecha Sword! We don't go to Mecha Sword. What? Oh, wait, I've got an idea. Mecha Sword, go! <laughs> Squat does. Look! Uh, 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 get moving, you giant dweeb! Nobody talks to my mega buddy like that! Fire mecha balls! Mecha boys, go! Yeah! Oh, win it! No fair! Time for a little camp stamping. <gasps> my cabin! You just squashed the wrong camp, butt squat! Mega charge! Ah! My beloved mess hall! Uh, I thought we were trying to stop him from destroying our camp! Ah! Yeah! Too strong! Feel the power of Mega Squat! You should have gone before we left. Huh? The meatball! We've got one shot to make it count. Activate! Make a gassy hand! Ha! You missed your one shot, McGoof! Actually, I meant to say two, but one sounded cooler. <laughs> it's working! <laughs> Any more meatballs? <laughs> Did I miss something? Uh, not much. Just Butt Squad using you as a giant destructo machine. <gasps> Me? Well, that's just not nice at all. <laughs> <laughs> you may have defeated Mega Squad, McGee, but now my giant Robo Butt is ready to stomp. <laughs> Leave our camp alone, you Robo Jerk! Yeah! <laughs> Squirt one, but squat zero. Now that you're a normal size squirt, I suggest not eating any exotic meatballs. Yeah! Now be 
a good bottom dweller. And grab a hammer. This camp ain't gonna fix itself. Activate Mecha Hammer. No? Let's go bottom dwellers. Smiles Waters. It ends tonight. I hereby seize these boys in the name of Camp Sunny Smiles. Hey, bottom freaks! Back on your side of the lake. You're dealing with the butt border patrol now. Got an attitude problem, tentacle boy. Lucky I don't run you in. Huh? That's littering. Consider this a warning. You better obey my laws or you'll be in big trouble, fish stick. Well, that takes care of that. <laughs> huh? Whoa! <laughs> you don't scare me, you, you freak from beneath. Oh. for super suction. <laughs> this face has never been cleaner. Time for a little reverse suction. Maybe too much power for a vacuum, but not for a kick butt. Flyboard! Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo! Go for <laughs> oh! Okay, who put this bad boy here? Butt Patrol! Big Nimrod, you are officially trespassing in Sunny Smiles waters. Uh, this is Lake Bottom's swim area. Yeah, butt snitch, you don't own the whole lake. This fence says I do. Got you for trespassing, damaging property, and for public lameness. But I'll go easy on you this time. Just stay on your side, and we won't have a problem. Oh, this side or this side? <laughs> How about this side? This? Don't make me lock you up, McGee! <laughs> 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 Keep that Slimosaurus away from me! It tried to eat my boat this morning! Whoa! Slimy doesn't eat junk food! And then it stole my new hat! Slimy, did you attack Officer Buttsplat's boat and steal his hat? Then you know what to do. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> You've been warned! Next time I see that stinky leech, it's off to the slug pound. Slug pound! But 
Squad! Squad asked for it. It's time to take our pranking to a whole new level, Slimy. Maybe Slimy should stay away from Butt Squad for a couple of days. <laughs> oh, relax. He's just having fun. The more fun Slimy has messing with Butt Squad, the better. So come on, Slimy. Let's get messing. Butt Border Patrol report. No sign of the bottom sneakers and their mucusy accomplice, but it's only a matter of time. And if I see them in my waters, they're gonna get some of this! And this! And this! Sh sh sharks? Get away! Shoo! Help! <laughs> Not funny, you guys! You could have gotten yourselves blasted! This thing is totally dangerous! Watch! <laughs> <laughs> that squid linquin better watch out. Actually, you better watch out. Oh, yeah, like I'm gonna fall for that one. <laughs> All right. Nice shot, butt smack. Time that goon's got a date with the deep fryer. Ah! Ah! Uh, I showed that jumbo calamari who's boss. Miles. Oh, Slimy's probably pranking Budwine and we're missing it! Come on! Save a wedgie for me, Slimy! <gasps> Call off your rabbit squid! <laughs> Slimy? No way! <laughs> See? Caught it red-handed! Er, red tentacled! You know what I mean! Oh, I turned our lake monster into a monster lake monster! Easy, Slimy, you're taking it too far. Slimy would never do something like that, right, McGee? First the hat, then those dents, and only something real big could have done that to the dark. <laughs> I'll teach you by turning your slimy pal into a sushi dinner. Say sayonara, tentacle breath. Mess with the butt patrol! <laughs> I can't believe Slimy is guilty! Guilty or not, <laughs> no one's getting Slimy on my watch! Ha! Even Magoo knows you're guilty! <laughs> Who called the elevator? You didn't tell me your slime thing is in a gang! <laughs> so it was an out of control rampaging lake monster! Just not our out of control rampaging lake monster. Then that means. Slimy is innocent! Never doubted it for a second. Of course you didn't, McGee. We're close where I can see them, Crab Breath. Ah! I don't need to see them that close. Ah! <laughs> Whoa! Ow! Officer down. <laughs> Here, I'll distract that thing while you free Slimy. Sorry I ever doubted you, Slimy. You forgive me? <laughs> Thanks, pal. Now let's go kick some crap butt. Bad, bad, bad! All right, Slimy! What 
What's happening? That's way too quiet! Slimy? Yeah, Slimy! Surf and turf that crusty crab! Yeah, yeah, your mutant calamari saved the day and stuff, but it shouldn't be off its leash. Huh? Ah! Extreme obnoxiousness, unlicensed boomerang, being a butthead, as if... You forgot trespassing on Camp Lake Bottom's side of the lake. Hey, put me down! See ya, butt squid. I will! Slimy, no more pranking. <laughs> Until tomorrow. <laughs>
sorry. I had the chili. I don't think that was your lunch! You mean you had the chili too? Gretchen! Squirt! Watch out for that first step! Whoa! Okay, this is new. Hey, this looks like Eddie. Only way bigger. Okay, McGee, what's up besides us? What makes you think that I... I... I mean, it could have been any. <laughs> Why is it always me? I... a little help here. <laughs> Whoa! So, McGee, how much fertilizer did you use? Well, let's see, a cup of... you know, with a dash, you know, with two pinches, and then carry the four, uh, all of it. McGee! Am I still asleep and dreaming, or is this more McGee mischief? It's my sister's birthday. Well, wish her a happy birthday from me. And also, why is my cabin a hundred feet in the air? Uh, still trying to work out the exact details. Okay, okay, I used a whole bag of your super fertilizer on one plant. Then the plant will keep growing until it cannot hold its own weight. Down it will go along with us. Great. We're going to be crushed by Susie's birthday present. The only way to stop the growth is to cut the flower from the top. I will make a lovely salad with it. Ah! 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 I'm on to the rescue. Whoa. Whoa. Rosebud! Oh, don't go anywhere! Oh, no overgrown snapdragon can hold this Sasquatch! Perhaps I spoke too soon. Ah! Come on! We have to rescue Rosebud and Armand! Whee! Uh, whose idea was this again? Don't eat us! We're not a basic food group! Oh, forget about the rescue campers. It's too dangerous. You've got to go up to the top. Stop this plant. Hmm. <laughs> Zombies are nice in town. Ooh, watermelons are on sale. Okay, what's the plan, fertilizer boy? What makes you think I have a plan? Because you always have a plan. Does the plan include a snack break? Well, um, no. Okay, here's the plan. We climb to the top. That's it? That's it. What could go wrong? Actually, lots of things could go wrong. First... Don't tell me, Squirt. It'll spoil the surprise. Ouchie! Sorry, Eddie, if this feels a little pokey and ouchie. Ow! Not cool. Phew. Break time! <laughs> Might not be the best time for a break, McGee! Run! <laughs> Quick! Grab onto me! Wait! Safety first! Admit, it's pretty cool that I turned a plant into a plantosaurus. Wonder what I should name it. Your butt. I should name a plant after my butt? No! Look out for your butt! <laughs> Let's climb! It worked! I did it! I'm safe from Susie! Okay, let's get those garden tools and go rescue our counselors. There's no way a sister can't forgive a brother for eating her birthday cake if she gets a flower like this. McGee, wait! What happens if you... Oh, oh! Ask me! Ask me! Yes, Squirt? If the flower is cut, the plant doesn't need its roots anymore. Oh, and the roots are what's holding us up. Uh... See? I was right. <laughs> Three. <laughs> 
No, wait. Don't! One, two, three. <laughs> Why did we run into our cabin? <laughs> I hope that's not Susie. Is there room for one more? Take my arm! No! Ah! Human and Sasquatch chain! <laughs> It. No more gardening for you. Okay. Hey. All right, McGee. I'm sick of coming over to this dump. I know Mom and Dad sent my present to you. Now give it! Happy birthday, sis. <sighs> well, it's way better than getting a, I don't know, birthday cake. <laughs> Everyone gets those. This is special. I guess it is kind of pretty. Uh... Oh, 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 I get it! You ate Susie's birthday cake and that's why you needed the flour. Say what?! It was a horrible cake anyway, Susie. It tasted way too... chocolatey. Uh. Happy birthday! Yeah, I'm gonna get some watermelons. Everybody loves a good watermelon. Uh, you might want to give it a minute. <laughs> I should start growing watermelons. Beetle shell pasta and toasty beak bites. Why do your snacks always have to crawl? Nice snack, loser bottoms. Mm. Feast your eyes on cheesy spaghetti a la squat, cooked by Chef Moi. One order of cheesy spaghetti a la squat. <laughs> that spaghetti isn't the only thing around here that's cheesy. Right, McGee? Uh-oh. <gasps> But no thanks, Butt Squat. We can't get enough of these itty bitty toasty beak bites. <laughs> can't resist real food. Yes. No. <laughs> oh, sorry, Rosebud. I cracked. You think cooking for picky campers is easy? You do it. But beware, Mr. Schmarty Chef. Cooking can be dangerous business. When it's your cooking, eating is dangerous busyness. I heard that. Relax. Chef McGee is in the kitchen. Oh, yeah. Dream on, McDream on. You wouldn't know a flipper thingy from a frying pan thingy. I could outcook you any day, butt burn. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Oh, yeah? Oh, boy, here it comes. Yeah. Oh, yeah? Yeah! Cook off! Presenting the first ever camp. Behold the cauldrons of gastronomical glory. Prepare to be blown away by my Squat Blaster 11 Alarm Chili. What's this thing? My McSpicy Apocalypse Smacking Chili will blast your chili out of the uh, pot with uh, mixing and cutting up stuff, I guess. You've never cooked in your life, have you? My tummy is already upset. How hard can it be? I'll just do what Rosebud does, except I'll make it good. I heard that, too. Chefs, here are your ingredient baskets. Now, go get your ingredients. Oh, yeah, food fans. This cook.
took off, just took off. You heard Armand. Let's get shopping. Indigestion, here we come. Whatever, weirdos. Yeah, I need a delivery of uh, stuff that goes in chili. And now, introducing the judge for this culinary crossfire. <laughs> Judge Rosebud, what are you looking for in today's cook-off? Just a quiet spa day. <laughs> and to see the smirk wiped off McGee's face. <laughs> can opener, can opener. <laughs> This'll do. Seriously? Chef Buttsquat. What's the winning secret of your chili? A secret? There's no secret. Out of my way. Gotta do chefy stuff. Chef McGee's really showing his culinary chops with these tough tomatoes. Hey, tomatoes! I've seen better looking vines holding up monkeys. <laughs> Hope you don't taste as bad as you aim. Mm. In the line of fire, and it tastes so good. Uh. Mm. Ah! <sighs> Chef Buttsquat is showing unorthodox flair and an inability to find a can opener. What? Uh, uh, no cans here. <laughs> Dented, but intact. Unlike Chef Buttsquat. Back to you. Even an expert chef would think twice about harvesting the lake bottom yak bean. Luckily, thinking has never been an issue for Chef McGee. There's one. <laughs> Let's stir things up, people! Uh, stirring is a cooking word, right? Beans! Tomatoes! Ooh, are those feet clean? No way! Toe Jam adds zest! Reek! We could ask Rosebud if we're doing it right. No, Rosebud! Chef McGee's got this! <laughs> Let McYuck waste time actually cooking. Once this heats up, I am donezo. Your key ingredient appears to be pre-cooked microwavable uh, chili. Anything else, Chef? Plus, um, my own super secret, super hot squat sauce that I bought myself. <laughs> we might want to call the fire department. So, you like it hot, do you? Uh, where'd that come from? Rosebud's padlock chained up, do not open danger cupboard. See? Cooking is easy. And if a little is good... No! Pretty. Disqualification! McCheater's chili is out of bounds! <laughs> what is our ruling, Judge Rosebud? Ow! Chili's still in play. A chef has to teach the food who's the boss. Now, more ruling! Oh, oh yeah! Oh, oh, that's the stuff. Ha! If you can't stand the heat, lean squad, get out of the cook-off! No way! <laughs> Ever heard of mouthwash? Holy heartburn! It's Chili Zuma's revenge! This chili chow down throwdown is really heating up. May the best chef survive! <laughs> yeah, hot, hot, hot! Just a tad overdone. <laughs> Eat flame retarded bone bean breath! You know, maybe now's a good time to ask Rosebud for help. You think? <laughs> Rosebud! Yeah! Rosebud, you gotta help us! What's the magic word? Ah! That's not it. <laughs> what are you gonna do now, chili chum? Way to make it angrier! <laughs> McGee, just apologize to Rosebud. Okay, I was wrong. Cooking isn't easy, especially at Lake Bottom where the food fights back. And? And I love your fruit. Uh, what, what? No, I, I didn't quite hear you. Ah! I love your food! Oh, you didn't have to say that. Will someone come up with a plan? I got a plan! <laughs> <laughs> Time to 
to chill out this chili ogre. <laughs> it's working. Take that, you overgrown pile. Why are you stopping? We're out of water. <laughs> when food goes this bad, it's time to change the recipe. Right on, Chef Rosebud. Run! <laughs> No chili meal is complete without side dishes. Fire coleslaw! Yes! We coal slaughtered him! Ugh. Fire cheese cannon! This better be Gouda. <laughs> that cheese won't hold for long. I need that sour cream, Rosebud! You think it's easy milking a sour batch cow? They're grumpy. That ogre's really hot under the collar. And over the collar. <laughs> There's only one way to know what this chili needs. A taste test. You're either braver or dumber than I thought. I knew my grandma's oven mitt would come in handy someday. A cast iron stomach would help too. Here, chef. May you taste sweet victory and not bitter defeat. On guard! You can make us fart chili, but you cannot take a delicious freedom! <laughs> no! Taste this! Oh! <laughs> uh, Uh-oh. Well, give me a sec. <laughs> Bad needs onions. Yes, chef. <laughs> no time for tears. Onions up. So is the sour cream. <laughs> McGoofy's that way. <laughs> ah! <sighs> this is your fault, McGee. What a battle, folks. And now, the moment of truth. Who is the winner of the Chow Gown Throwdown? Mm -mm, it is spicy. Yeah, it's always creamy. <laughs> this a butt squad aftertaste. No winner. Oh, yes, there is. Winner and still champion, Chef Rosebud! <laughs> It tastes pretty good. Blech. Spicy. It's not gonna shake itself. I don't know, Sawyer. I don't think this is gonna work. See? Huh? Uh, uh. 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 Best batch of bird poop yet. There's more on me than in that basket. Oh, I'd give anything for a poop-proof sweater. Please tell me this isn't for Rosebud's pancake mix. This poop's not for eating, you silly. It's for the most splendiferous monumental monster holiday ever. <laughs> It's Doo Doo Day! It comes from above in a flourish of feathers, the most joyous and gruesome of all get together. It's Doo Doo Day! It's Doo Doo Day! It's the Fowl Family Food Day! That Doo Doo Day? As in Doo Doo? It's whatever you want it to be. I choose to believe it's Doo Doo, as in the glorious hairdo of the magical permadactyl. The perma what? Oh, the great permadactyl flies down from the sky. If we show our gratitude, and if we make her feel welcome. And butter hops at Wazoo's compliments. Then she rewards every monster with special eggs containing the best presents ever. Presents? I'm in. Hold your hoofskies. We never had campers for Dodo Day before. You must respect our traditions. What? Me? Not respectful? Come on. No one is a bigger respecter of presents, I mean traditions, than me. Right, guys? Please? <laughs> please? <laughs> Pretty please? Oh, fine.
fine. You can join us for the celebration. Yeah! We're getting presents! We're getting presents! I'm afraid I make a huge mistake. Ah, uh, you think? Nothing is better than presents! High five! Yeah! Now that's the do do don't. Funny. Real funny. Permit Jackson's gonna love our traditional do do day next. More hay, please. Huh, it's good. But you know what would make it great? What, more help? Nope, more everything. <laughs> it's nice seeing a camper full of the doo-doo day spirit. Oh, he's full of it, all right. Whoa! Now that's a doo-doo day nest. Hey, Armand, need a hand? No, thank you, McGee. The permadactyl's runway carpet is complete. Hmm, or is it? After all, a runway needs landing lights. <sighs> Shoo, shoo, you pesky plane! This is for the permadactyl! Does this doo-doo day garland have enough belly button lint? When it comes to the holidays, enough is never enough. <laughs> Innie, outie! <laughs> Innie, outie! Oh, yay, outie! Nothing too good for presents. I mean, the permadactyl. Can I get a yay? Yay! <laughs> wow, you guys should try this! Barf. These eggs are rotten. Unz's cream is curdled. Perfect for the traditional egg bog. Hmm. This egg bog is not revolting enough. Keep peddling. Heck yeah. Bump repeaters. <laughs> Gross stuff and presents. Oh, this holiday is awesome. Oh, yeah. You're the king of doo doo, all right. <laughs> <laughs> We need more hair for the traditional doo-doo day doo-doo wigs. No problemo. Hmm. No way. Oh, come on, guys. Where's your doo-doo day spirit? Bed. Now. Sleep. How can you sleep? It's time to hang our doo-doo day stinky meat socks. Ew! See, I covered mine in blue cheese and left it out in the sun all day. Happy Doo Doo Day Eve, guys! Doo Doo Day! Socks full of flies. That's good, I think. Happy Doo Doo Day, everyone! Happy Doo Doo Day, McGee! What he said. Happy Doo Doo Day, campers! Dactyl wigs for all! Not gonna happen. But, Gretch, you have to, or we won't get our amazing presents! Is that why you're being such a Doo Doo Day ding dong? Presents? No, maybe. Mostly. Aw, oh, come on, Gretchen, just put on the wig, please! Move it! Doo Doo Day waits for no one! As the doo doos do. It's a doo doo day. It's doo doo day. It's the foul family food day. Ah, it's him! Or her! Or it? Nope. Nope. There! There she is! Happy doo doo day, Permadactyl! Bring on the prezzies! Remember, campus, you must flatter the Permadactyl! Your mullet is magnificent! I made your favorite egg bog and cookies with extra maggots! Oh. Isn't he absolutely majestic? Well, that vest is pretty rad. <laughs> Permadactyl, I totally get why it's called Doo Doo Day. Because that hairdo is Doo Doo Awesome! <laughs> A pony with a sharp forehead. What every Sasquatch dreams of. Huh, new designer zombie wear. It will be like cooking for the gods. Dreams can't come true. Ah, 
love baby. Time to get what I always wished for. Best present ever? What's this? Are you kidding me? <laughs> Sorry, he's a human. He doesn't know what he's saying. Does this look like a bite to you? Quiet. This is the lamest gift ever. There, there, permadoctors. No need to get hot under the collar. Who would want to be caught in a nerd catcher like this? Okie dokie. Time to run! Oh, so the bird took off. What's the big deal? The big deal is you have doomed us all! Huh? That cuckoo has wiped out entire suburbs for less than what you just did. Taken out? How? I think we're about to find out. Take cover, camper! The trench is in the Just had my fur dry cleaned. Piggy, <laughs> stop! The permadactyl's after you! Anyone close to you is going down! Sorry, Grant! No! Get down! <laughs> ha! Looks like I hit that one out of the park. Wretched! Ew! Well, at least it's not a flying elephant. It comes from above in a flourish of feathers. The most joyous and gruesome of all get together. No! Squirt, get out of there! Leave my friends alone, you flea-bitten bag of feathers! Ah! I hate it when Gretchen's right. <laughs> Way to go, McGee. It's poop Mageddon out there, thanks to you. It's not my fault that bird blew its tail feathers. Actually, it's totally your fault. Okay, I wanted the best present ever. It's all I could think about. Is that so wrong? Yes. yes. I'm sorry, guys. I put you all in danger and ruined doo-doo day. You forgot about being a selfish, bossy dumbbat. Oh, yeah, how could I forget that? I'm gonna fix this. Somehow. It's too late! The permodactyl's gonna take out the whole camp just to get at you! Run for it! No! My friends had nothing to do with this! I'm the one you want! Hey, Perby! Come and get me! Go, go, go! Oh. Yes! <laughs> oh, wait! I'm wearing my wonderful sweater! See? No more running. I deserve this! For friends, for camp, for everything. Thanks for the present! It's a doo-doo day miracle! Hey, this is the poop-proof sweater I asked for! Awesome! I get doo-doo day now. It isn't about the presents. It's about being grateful. Sorry, guys, for all the trouble I've caused. Thank you, Primodactyl! This is the best gift ever! It comes from above in a flourish of feathers, the most joyous and gruesome of all get togethers. It's doo doo day! It's doo doo day! It's the Flowers Family Food Day! That. This is the part of the holidays I like. Yep, and I can't wait for next year. Whoops.